close till I get up. I got this on Amazon, by the way. It was, I guess, on sale compared to a lot of the other places. So I got it for about 50 bucks, I believe, which isn't that bad. Okay, it does not come together, so I will have to assemble this in front of you guys, probably. I didn't even use the instructions. It goes like that. Ugh, hurt, hurt myself in the process. That's okay. And other stuff. There we go. Alright guys, so I basically finished up assembling the stroller, the 3D light summer infant stroller. It is, I believe, 11 pounds and you can have your child be in this specific stroller, I think, until 50 pounds. I will post in the description box below if I'm not correct. You'll see everything there. So my first impression of this is that it has so much sun coverage because at first I had it like that, but it's supposed to go like this. I had it placed on correctly. I ended up realizing that too late, but this just pulls out and you can have more shade for your toddler or baby. Wow, that's so smooth. I love this stroller already. My umbrella stroller sucks, you guys. Like, upgrade because it's so worth it after your child starts to get a lot heavier. Those little strollers just don't do the trick. Water. That one fits perfectly fine in there. And then in here, you can honestly fit just your phone, a camera, like the G7X that I'm using. I would put it in here in my phone. Honestly, you can carry a really small wallet. I would say the square one, not the long rectangular one. I mean, you could try, but I don't think this thing would close. It's kind of small. So right here in the bottom, you can fit up a lot of things. I'm going to show you an example of how much you can fit. You can compare it to the box. So and it obviously has books in here. So. Guys, it fits perfectly fine. That's how much room it has. You could put everything that you would use in your diaper bag and leave it in here. Like I would leave diapers, wipes, and a changing pad in here. That's all you need and maybe a couple of snacks. I hold so many things. The one thing that's missing that I don't think I have, oh yes I do. Okay, so it's basically this. 
you can make this bigger and then you basically carry it on your back if you need to transport it like in an airport or something but this is basically the front of it I just wanted to do this review for you guys because I think I read enough reviews and it's such a great stroller honestly the only down part to this stroller like I said is that it doesn't have a tray this is my old stroller and this is my new stroller it's basically for the price I got this it's a $40 difference they both don't have snack trays as you can tell this one's just a lot lighter yes it's like a $25 $20 stroller and this is a lot more expensive but I think you get a more bang for your buck if you buy the summer infant instead of wasting your money on a 20 or $25 stroller if you have the money I suggest that you invest in this because it will last you a long time compared to this one if it's one out of five stars it's a four point four point five I would give it because I'm pretty sure there's like a five star rating stroller out there but that one's gonna cost you like two hundred dollars and it probably has a tray and gives massages and gives your baby some cooling system I don't know probably it's probably gonna take his first nap so this is when I get ready for the day and I'll see you guys soon I'll probably take you to my appointment for my wisdom teeth removal follow-up so it's been two weeks now and I still feel some stitches in there, so those haven't fallen out, but I think they're going to take them out. I'm not sure. I'll let you guys know, but I'll see you guys soon, and I will also take the stroller with me and with Nathaniel in the same vlog, so stay tuned or just skip the part when I go to the dentist, the oral surgeon, so just stay tuned, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!